what do you think about this? I'm gonna run myself on the road. <laughs> No, wave to the camera. Just wave. There you go. Burger came, Corey came back. That. Like Ryan, come. Free place to stay? Do I go to the beach or not? Tough question. Who? I think I know how to fix this. I'm gonna push my knees outward. Pretty sure that will fix this. I can't remember what I told this kid. I think I told him just to like keep his knee locked at the 45. I like literally like my knees don't even don't even think about them. That's the funny part. I'm gonna, like, I mean I guess that might work. I'll try and think of it always pointing there. I'm gonna just think of it pointing there. I guess. Here we go. Let me just shoot a video to Jack of you. I'll do one regular one and I'll do one not regular one. Okay, here's the regular one. I did feel it this time. Here's, I'm gonna push the knee that way. Oh, that felt so weird. That felt good. You did it well. That felt so quiet. Yeah. So in golf, I had one uh, guy, my one, why I went to do one golf lesson, right? And he's like, push your knees outward. Like, push your knees buckling too much, push your knees outward. So I was like, huh, maybe I'll try that. So I thought about that, but then you said the 45, so I was like, great, I'll just feel like this knee pushes yeah. outward. Right? And then... My leg work feels so much better. Yeah. My that's, surf feels so much better. That... Dude, I'm telling you, that's so horizontal that if you got that vertical, you're gonna have a killer. All right. So, we, uh... Wait, I'll get it, I'll get it restarted. Okay, so, it is pretty much the hottest day of the week. We have uh, been out here doing some drills, hitting with one of the juniors that I'm training over at Inverness. Um, but yeah, we, we did a couple of Spanish style drills after some hitting. We did this one, you know, just like a typical one side to side, probably like 40 to 60 something balls. And then we did that twice. And then the next one we did was like rapid fire. So you just like drop the ball in the same spot over and over and over again. And like the only goal for that is to literally let it whip out like super hard and out completely letting it go and then like facing the hit and using the hip to uh to hit the ball so those two things were not the things that tired me out um i actually feel great i'm just absolutely soaked in water like literally look at my shorts and, and shirt like this is not the color of the shirt but this is like literally my shorts are soaked through completely like i've never sweat uh out my entire like in my entire shorts but yeah this shirt is absolutely soaked it's like what it's like 97 degrees right now um but yeah it's like super hot but honestly i feel good so that's a thing it's a really good thing it feels like my cardio is getting a lot back more in shape i'm i'm doing great uh i'm doing a good job of dealing with the heat so i think for any matches that's good but yeah for this week like really getting this kind of fundamental practice in felt really good didn't uh bring my my you know my trident with uh with me to record our set that we played but you know, he wasn't putting many stars in, so it didn't really matter. However, I think the drilling alone just felt awesome. I just like really felt like I was connecting with my arm. I felt something at the end of the points there with my backhand, like the way the elbow was coming out. And it felt like it locked the wrist in a certain position to not come this way, but stay this way with the ball. So if I'm hitting through the ball that way, it felt good. Instead of like coming more like that, it felt like through it. So it felt really good. Um, and that was, that was exciting to feel like a lot better in my backhand and like, I would look up sometimes and like the backhand was like going deep in the corner. It just felt like perfect. So laying a little bit more back in the ball. And uh, I think that rapid fire drill was super good for that. Um, forehand felt a little bit low over the net, which was, I mean, you know, that is what it is. But like, I think if I get a little bit higher, that'd be a lot better, more penetrating into the court in terms of depth and spin. So this week, this uh, has felt pretty good. Getting some things working, service feeling better with the legs. And uh, I think that's really a massive thing. My, I've had that leg issue for probably 
So I was like, at least 10. I think looking back at some videos, at least 10, if not earlier. And fixing that like randomly with coal was just like insane to me. I didn't ever think I was gonna be able to do that. So now my legs look like I actually am a good tennis player on the serve, which is fantastic. Um, yeah, serves feeling good. Backhand today felt a lot better. And forehand is getting there even, even more like dangerous now. So everything's starting to connect a lot better and uh, feeling good. So I need to figure out the next tournament to play. I uh, have to figure out where I'm gonna, what I'm going to register for, but whatever it is, I'm, I'm starting to feel really good about my tennis.